Hello everyone, I'm of course John Doe right here in Tokyo, Japan and we're going to do another Ghost Letters Report video. Now it's clearly obvious by now, unless you've been living under a rock, that there's been a terrorist attack in Paris and well over a hundred people have been killed in something that Paris at this magnitude hasn't experienced in quite some time. It's got a lot of attention internationally and the Western world is making a huge deal about it. You know, it's, a, it's something you can't really escape right now. So, <clears throat> with that in mind, I thought I'd make a video about it. Talk about this a little bit. And just some ob observations that I've kind of noticed. What really got me thinking about this is when President Bashar from Syria spoke on this. And he was kind of saying, he gives a, a lot of condolences to the French people. And he understands how they feel because in Syria, a terrorist attack is something that happens every day. <coughs> and I think there's a lot to be said about such a statement, you know. When you look at it, right, the people of France, up until now, most people in, in Paris know nothing about what it's like to live in an environment where at any moment, chaos can erupt and mass murder can go on for ideological, religious, and various other reasons. Now, a lot of people can be killed at any moment, any time. And they, they really don't know what that's like. So it's a bit of a shock to them. What is more interesting than even that is that this type of thing does in fact go on in Syria and many other places in the world daily. And instead of people <coughs> educating themselves about that and knowing about that, they only focus on when it happens in, in a Western country and a a very powerful capitalist country. That's when it matters. That's when it's important. You know, but a random daily terrorist attack in Syria or Iraq or Nigeria or any other place in the world that's not one of these first world imperialist powers, people seem to not really care about it so much. And I find that to be a bit hypocritical. If you say you're really against terrorism, and you honestly believe that terrorism is a bad thing, then something that happens in France like this, and something that happens in Syria and other places, should be equally as important to you. And you should be equally as outraged by it. But many people are not. You know? You see a lot of time in the news. You see a light mention. A passing mention. Of a terrorist attack in a country. That's not. In favor. Or doesn't have the golden graces. And one of the major capitalist powers in the world. And more people are like, well, there's another one. That's just how it is there. But it happened in a place like Paris. And suddenly, oh God, oh no. It's a big issue. We got to do something about it. We got to stop this. We got to fight those evil people that did it. But what about those same evil people who do the same exact thing? 
in a country like Syria or Iraq or Afghanistan or Nigeria or various other places in the world. It's the same exact people doing these things. But you only care when it happens in the comfortable capitalist Western world. And that I find to be unacceptable and really hypocritical and really disappoints me. Yeah. But I want to hear what you think about this, what I've said in this video and what your, your take on this is. Please leave a comment in the comment section below. First time you see me, please subscribe. Lots of vids like this, plus a slew of other things from time to time. Until next time, this is me, John Doe in Tokyo. Check it out.